there were two famous Christians in Ephesus named John. One was John, the beloved apostle, and the other was John the Presbyter, or John the Elder. And he was very gifted in Christianity also. And some think it was John the Elder, not John the Apostle, who was in the Isle of Patmos. One of the great Greek scholars in church history, Dionysius of Alexandria, called Dionysius the Great. Eusebius devotes a whole chapter to this great Dionysius who lived around uh, 250 AD. He knew his Greek grammar and he knew Greek uh, like the back of his hand. And he pointed out that the Greek of the book of Revelation is somewhat inferior to the great Greek in the Gospel of John and the Johannine letters. And he says that, notice the Gospel of John is anonymous, and so are the letters, but the book of Revelation mentions John several times, doesn't it? The spirit, I was sitting in the cave in Cat Patmos, and the Spirit told me, John, what to write, and so forth. Now, it's not that people can't change their literary style over a lifetime. I hope mine's improved. But um, it, there's a, a problem there yet. But that doesn't, again, deny the importance of the book. Uh, and some who don't like the book of Revelation said it shouldn't have come in the canon and that we're not going to go that route. <laughs>